Hello, dear students. This is your engineering mathematics three lecture. In last lecture, we have discussed mean deviation, arithmetic mean, and standard deviation. The topics from third unit statistics. We are going to continue the same topic here, and in that topic, the next uh, already we have discussed the results or formula of coefficient of variation in last lecture. We are going to solve the example on. Coefficient of variation. See the example. Goals scored by two teams A and B in a football season were as follows. Determine which team is more consistent. We have to determine which team is more consistent. Means here in this example, the data of two terms is given: team A and team B. The scored goal scored by two teams. The data is given. Two teams of football. The data is given for these two teams. Now, for to determine which team is more consistent, here we have to find out the arithmetic mean, standard deviation, and coefficient of variation for every team. Means for team A, you find out the arithmetic mean, standard deviation, and Coefficient of variation. Then for team B, also you find the arithmetic mean, standard deviation, and coefficient of variation. Then after finding the coefficient of variation for both the teams, team A and team B, we will determine which team is more consistent. Okay. So first, we are going to find the arithmetic mean, standard deviation, and CV means coefficient of variation for team A. So you construct the table for team A from the given data. Number of goals. The first column is number of goals. Variable column X is zero, one, two, three, four. Because the in the given data the number of goals scored are here zero, one, two, three, four. So the number of goals scored that column is representing the Variable x, zero, one, two, three, four. The next column, the number of matches means frequencies for team A. We are discussing about team A. Means zero goals are there in twenty-seven matches. One goal in nine matches. Two goals in eight matches. Three goals in five matches. Five, four goals in four matches. So twenty-seven, nine, eight, five, four. These are the frequencies for the goals zero, one, two, three, four, respectively. So second column is of frequency. Means number of matches. Third column F into x. We require this f x term to find the arithmetic mean. Then next term x square, and the last column f into x square. So we require this f into x square. Term to calculate the standard deviation. Okay, so you do the addition of all the terms means you find summation f, summation f x, summation f x square. Then you find arithmetic mean for team A. It is x suffix a. Suffix a is for team A. So x a bar is equal to summation f x upon summation f. Now summation f is fifty three and Sorry, summation f x is fifty six and summation f is fifty three. So put here the values, fifty six upon fifty three, and the calculated value is one point zero five double six. So this is the arithmetic mean for team A. Now the standard deviation for team A, the formula for standard deviation, sigma suffix A, suffix A for team A, is equal to under root. Summation f x square upon summation f minus summation f x upon summation f whole square. Now, what is summation f x square? Its value is one fifty. So, put summation f x square is equal to one fifty upon summation f. Summation f is fifty three. So, put here fifty three minus summation f x upon summation f. This is the formula of arithmetic mean. So, its value we have calculated it. It is one point zero five double six, and then the square of this. Arithmetic mean. Now simplify or calculate this value under root one fifty upon fifty three minus bracket one point zero five double six whole square, and the calculated value is one point three one. 
So standard deviation for team A, sigma A is equal to 1.31. Now calculate the coefficient of variation, CV. Its formula, so fix CV, so fix A means coefficient of variation for team A is equal to standard deviation for team A upon arithmetic mean of team A into 100. It means sigma A upon X A, X bar A. Sigma A, standard deviation for team A, X A bar, arithmetic mean for team A into 100. This is the formula of CV, coefficient of variation. We uh, discussed in, in previous lecture, coefficient of variation, its formula. Put here the values. Sigma A is 1.31, put here the value of Sigma A. For X, X A bar, arithmetic mean for team A is 1.0566, put here the value into 100. You simplify and calculate the value. It is equal to 123.9825. So this is the CV for team A. Now for team B, you construct the table for team B. And here the first column is number of goals. This is the variable column 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Like the table of team A, here is the table of team B. Second column matches, frequencies, I means zero goals are in 17 matches, one goal in nine matches, two goals in six matches, three goals in five matches, four goals in three matches. So frequency distribution is given here. And then the next column is F into X. The next is column is X square. And the last one is F into X square. And then you do the addition of all the terms, means summation F, you calculate summation F means addition of all the values of frequencies that is summation f summation fx f into x and then addition of all the terms in that third column fx is 48 summation fx square it is 126 now you calculate the arithmetic mean for team b and the notation is x suffix b b for team b x b bar equal to summation fx upon summation f Summation fx, its value is 48 and summation f is 40. So you put here the values and calculate 48 upon 40, it is equal to 1.2. So the arithmetic mean for team B is 1.2. Now you calculate the standard deviation for team B and the notation is sigma suffix B, B for team B. It is equal to under root summation fx square upon summation f minus summation fx upon summation f whole square. Now here put the values of all the terms. Means summation f x square is very 126. Summation f is 40. Minus summation f x upon summation f means arithmetic mean for team B. It is 1.2, 1.2 whole square. You put here all the values and calculate it. It is equal to 1.3. So standard deviation for team B is 1.3. Then you calculate the coefficient of variation CV suffix B coefficient of variation for team B. It is sigma B upon XB bar. Sigma B means standard deviation for team B upon XB bar means arithmetic mean for team B in 200. You put here all the values, then you will get its value 108.97. Calculated sigma B, it is 1.3. XB bar, it is 1.2 in 200. If we calculate this term, it is equal to 108.97. 9724. Okay, so this is the coefficient of variation for team B. Here, coefficient of variation for team B is 108.97, and coefficient of variation for team A it is 123.98. So, coefficient of variation for team B is less than coefficient of variation for team A, and so team B is more consistent. That is at conclusion. It means that if the CV is less, then that term or that class is consistent, more consistent as compared to the other one. If CV is more, then uh, the conclusion will be it shows greater variability. Here in this example, coefficient of variation for team A is more, so team A shows more variability. Coefficient of variation of TB, team B, coefficient of variation of team B is less. So it is more consistent. So this is the conclusion for the given data. So this topic coefficient of variation is over here. This session is also over here.
थैंक यू